in the season finale last night? Yeah, I did. What did you think about it? It was a little too dramatic for me. Not too, too dramatic for you? I thought it was good. Well, it's just, you know, the lovers go, the captain dies, stuff like that. It's too cliche. Too, too cliche. You and your too cliche rants, you tap the old guy. The face the cock! Doctor. Can we do the dance, freaks? I got it. It would be too illogical. <sighs> Guys, it's not nice to make fun of people just because they're not like you. Whatever. We probably shouldn't go. I mean, we just shouldn't. Wait a minute. You do not want to go, right? Oh no. You mean that look on your face that you have a crazy scheme going on. No, just no. And besides, we need dates. It says right there, bring a date. My friend, I have just the thing. Oh no. I really need help. Okay, so there are these two amazing guys. So the first one is like super smart and confident, but he can get a little overexcited and he's kind of bossy, but he is so nice. And I mean, he's a brunette, so you can't go wrong there. And then the second guy is really sweet most of the time, except when he like wanders off and doesn't pay attention at all. But he's got this gorgeous mane of red hair. And I just can't decide between them. Like, I want to take them both out. It's such a dilemma. That, that does seem like quite a predicament. I'm very complicated. Yeah, I'm like, more so than we had really anticipated at, at this project here. So, um, if you could give Pierce and I a moment to confer about this, we could get back to you. Why did you start the business in the first place? Because I never anticipated something like this happened. This is insane! If you're yeah, yeah, coming yeah. to the dance, you should have just done what I told you to do. You ask someone. What? You think that, that would have worked out really well, what with how we are socially in this school? Okay, okay. that's it. What? What? How do you think this is supposed to go? What? Uh, Shouldn't we figure out who, who she's talking about first? She's talking about us, you... Obviously. Oh, please. You're not that smart. Don't fly to yourself. And wait, do I really just ponder off and don't pay attention sometimes? All the time. Well, I guess I do have pretty good hair, but it's not like we can go out there and tell her to choose one of us. I know, I know. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Let me think so. Alright, I got it, I got it. We go out there, we give her advice. We give her advice that, that's neutral. It's like, it doesn't go either way. So, it's like, like follow your heart or something. I don't know. Okay. Come, come on, we'll make it work. Okay. Are you sure this is gonna work? Am I sure this is gonna work? No, of course I'm not sure this is going to work. I'm winging it. But you said you're the boss. Yes, I am the boss. That does not mean I have a perfect plan for everything. Okay, okay, okay. I can't be. I can't be. Hi, we're back. We're back. Come back. Finished our liberation. Yeah. Everything's good. Everything's fine. Yes, and we're deeply sorry about that. And we've come to conclusions. So, what you need to do? What you need to do? Follow your heart. What kind of stupid movie cliche is that? But like, like we said, you, you have a complicated situation and we don't think we can intervene in this case. <clears throat> I know this was unfortunate, but if our services help whatsoever, then 
Yeah, we'd appreciate some feedback about how our service has helped. Yeah, uh, nothing like some purely professional feedback, right, Franklin? Yeah, yeah, of course, of course, Pierce. Uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thanks. Bye. Yes, yes, of course. Bye. Bye. You did put my email address on there too, right? Um, I hope. Ah, uh, uh, must must have slipped my mind. Um, on, on, honest mistake, really. Don't let you tell my fault that I. Check your email. She probably sent you something. Hold on. Come on. You're, you're not gonna like this. I told you you should put my phone number in there. No, no, it, it's not that. Look at this. 